I would rather eat quavers than a six week stale. Tie up the man bun of Gareth Bale. Listen to the songs of Jimmy Nail. Then read one page of the Daily Mail. I'm Brian Bilston and I write poems. Uh, so I started posting some of my poems up on Twitter about two or three years ago. I think one um, maybe slightly deluded soul described me as the poet laureate of Twitter. Also others have made a kind of comparison to Banksy, which also is also very amusing to me. Skew, spew, balmy hairdo, cutthroat, bigot and smug. I'm keen on uh, presenting my poems in, in different forms and different formats. So an example of that would be uh, a poem called Love Excels, which is about uh, Excel spreadsheets, which I presented uh, with words contained within cells of an Excel spreadsheet itself. Uh, I have a, a poem set within a Venn diagram, which gives you two people's different perspectives in each half of that Venn diagram. My Refugees poem, which if you read from top to bottom, is a rather harsh critique of refugeeism, uh, but if you read from bottom to top, you'll find a completely different kind of story unravelling. I carefully fold so the corners will meet, straighten the edges to make them all neat, but deep down I know it will end in defeat. I shall never fold correctly a fitted sheet. I write a lot of poems about uh, the kind of banality of everyday life. Let's make love as soon as we're able, when the plates are cleared from the table. The dishwasher stacked neatly and the surfaces completely wiped clean of crumbs and yolk. We can leave the pans to soak. Let our bodies writhe and manoeuvre when I finish with the hoover. Let our love be abandoned, exciting, after I've done the recycling. The lilac sack securely tied and placed in the street outside, careful not to cause obstruction. And so begins the sweet seduction. I've recently had a book that's been crowdsourced and that got funded within, uh, within about two and a half days and I was expecting it to take uh, maybe three or four months and maybe not even then make it. So uh, yeah, it's a constant source of surprise to me. Oh, how I love to consume a satsuma. A satsuma a day leads to good humour. Juicy, sweet, segmental sensation. Luscious, litmus testing, citrus besting, Christmas elation. Oh, how I love to consume a satsuma. It is also easier to rhyme than orange. <laughs>